Michael Costello is what fellow teammates like to call an old pro. I do track and field, play tennis, I do bowling, and for hockey. You're a year-round athlete. Yes, I am. He's one of more than 2,500 athletes from around the state competing in this year's Special Olympics New Jersey Summer Games. Yeah! They're just amazing. They know everything about the game. It's not easy to become more and more confident in a particular uh, in a particular sport. These guys do it. They do it under the direction of volunteer coaches. Uh, they do it religiously. They do it regularly. Uh, and then they come here and they have the opportunity to celebrate that. It's a weekend-long event held at the College of New Jersey in Ewing. Athletes compete in seven sports. They have to play on a local level to qualify. There is nothing like the athletes. That's what we're all about, their enthusiasm. I have often said this is one of the truest forms of sport. Hundreds of volunteers will help the games go off without a hitch, like Taylor Reese, who started volunteering during the fourth grade. They make me smile. I mean, I have fun. I like seeing them smile and joke around with them. So it's just really fulfilling for me. Families like the Waldecks make long treks from all corners of the state, and they say it's worth every minute. It's hard to be a part of the team when you have any type of special needs. So it's awesome for them. They get down here, they stay in dorms together, they do all sorts of activities, they cheer each other on. When they win, it's happy, and when they don't win, it's still happy. The athletes will have to tough out the heat for 56 matches throughout the day leading up to the official kickoff tonight, opening ceremonies. You got all those people cheering on for you, wishing you the best of luck for a great weekend. It's a great way to start the weekend, and the more people have, you have cheering, the better your play. I'm hoping to see some of the records players. Last year I got Gary no uh, no Nova's autograph, so I'm hoping to wish, he's, wish he was back. At the end, on Sundays, you just sit here and you cry when they're all getting their medals, no matter who's getting the medal. <laughs> the awards are a bonus. Many of these athletes just love being a part of the team. Just being with um, friends and um, doing my best. And even if there is no medal? I'll be fine with it, as long as I have my friends around. Because they take the Special Olympics oath to heart. Let me win, but if I cannot win, let me be brave in the attempt. In Ewing, I'm Brianna Venosi, NJ TV News.